I don't know if you can hear it, but I'm a bit sick, so I might be coughing a lot. I hope I don't scare you guys with the coughing. I'll make sure to uh, keep my hand in front of my mouth, because I wouldn't want you guys to get... I was gonna say I wouldn't want you guys to get sick, but there's a screen between us, so... I am already having live stream struggles, and it hasn't even started yet, so it's gonna be a great day, guys. I just want to give a quick shout out to uh, Sofia Rojas. I cannot pronounce her last name, probably, because I'm Dutch, which is my excuse to pronouncing anything wrong. Um, yeah, I want to give her a shout out because she's kind of the reason I started doing these uh, reaction videos because she's a YouTuber and she makes um, reaction videos to 100 as well and she analyzes the episodes so well and she can explain pretty much everything about Klexa she can actually voice everything which I'm terrible at as you can probably tell right now it's about to start yes yay! Clark and Lexa are riding horses Oh. Oh, Alexa's smiling. We bring them peace. It's so sad because that's what she thinks right now. That she brings them peace, but then the only one is gonna fuck up. Twenty-four hours ago, you elected me a chancellor. Every action I've taken since, and every action I will take, the creation of a self-sustaining, prosperous, and safe Arcadia. Like, you just fucked everything up. Oh no, Clark and Lexus. Oh no, they're gonna find the dead people. Oh no, no, they were just smiling. Oh my god, no, they're all dead. No. Why does Lexa have to keep going through this? Why do her people always die? Like, right when there's peace, Bike fucks it all up. And I am so upset with Bellamy that he helped. Why? I feel like it's very necessary to hear um, Bellamy's story on this, to see it from his perspective. Because this shit is just messed up. Waste to Arcadia and everyone within its walls. Oh no, Lexa. Wait. They're not gonna do that, Lexa. Give me time to fix this. Clark, you better fix it. Or actually just get some of the people out who are really nice and then You know, sure Bellamy is like kind of saying that they're going too far in what they do. Like he's kind of trying to stop Pike on a down low, but at the same time he still helped them kill 300 people. I know that there's gonna be lots of people who are gonna defend Bellamy's actions already, but... Please... Realize that this is unforgivable at this point. But you didn't really save anyone because they were there to protect you. No, Bellamy. Just feel bad. Don't try to justify what you just did. Please just realize that it was wrong. Or don't. You will anyway. It's gonna be so great. Like from the promo, we know that Octavia is gonna like beat Bellamy up. I'm so excited. Like, you know it's bad when you're like more excited for Jaha to be uh, the Chancellor than Pike. Not gonna lie, this guy kinda looks like Matt Damon. Matt Damon's dead! Wait, is that guy's name Dotan? Because that's awesome. Like from the music they use, the song Home. Pike, you little shithead. Sure. 
How the hell did he win each other's for ship over King? He saved Indra's life, but he killed 300 people, Clark. Like, it's good to have faith in your friend. You know, if anyone can kind of make uh, Bellamy realize that what he did was wrong, it's either Clark or Octavia. So I'm really hoping that he realizes that he, he's doing the wrong thing, you know? I've drank like 70 ounces of water already because my throat's so itchy. I'm Dutch, so I don't actually know what an ounce is. But 70 ounces isn't like too crazy, but is it? Well, Raven's gonna be a little city of light at it. Be strong, Raven. Be strong. Tell me. Lexa and I. The Ice Queen is dead. The beasts tell me that going to war is not what you want. Tell me. Clark, how are you not beating him up right now? I'm trying so hard to see this from his perspective. But he's making it really hard. No, Clark, don't cry. I get that he doesn't trust the grounders, but... Oh my god, what a little shithead. He's trying to justify the fact that he just killed 300 people who were there to protect them. And now he's blaming it on, on Clark? Bellamy, you're such a fuck up right now. Oh my god, Bellamy! I don't... I don't know what to say right now. Kinda just... want Lexa to... wipe out Arcadia. Get Abby, Kane, Indra, Raven, Octavia, Clark out of there and just wipe out the rest. I am all about um, seeing everything in uh, perspectives. What Bellamy is doing from his perspective, and I get that. He doesn't trust the grounders before, because of so many reasons. Like, they killed Gina, um, Alexa left them to die, and b even before all that. You know, like Bellamy said, they've always been at war. But this, he literally kind of blamed it on Clark because Clark left. He killed 300 innocent people who were there to protect them. And then he he handcuffs Clark and after she even tells him that she knows they can fix it. I was already like, bro, there's no fixing this shit. But she still believes in him and then he does that. Well, I mean, what happened to you? I don't, I don't know what to say. At this point, I really don't know if I want Raven to go to the City of Light or not. I don't trust the whole City of Light thing. I don't trust Jaha. But at the same time, if Raven can actually be there without pain, that would be great. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Clark just took out Bellamy. Wait, so Alexa has the sacred symbol on her neck. Which is the symbol of the City of Light? That shit confuses me. Has to take the first step. Well, I mean, Alex is obviously gonna take that first step. Because she's not gonna wipe, wipe out Arcadia. What? Her people are so not gonna be happy with this. But you know, Alex is a good commander. And she's like a revolutionary commander, but at the same time, I'm like, like at this point, all the previous times, I would have been like, no, don't do it, Lexa. But this time, I'm like, I wouldn't mind if you just slayed Arcadia. I don't know if I'm actually happy about the fact that she isn't going to retaliate. You know how Lex always talks about um, choosing her head over her heart. I don't think she chose her heart over her head by. Um, agreeing with Clark. I think she kind of 
she's kind of learned how to combine the two, but I'm just kind of on the fence about it. <coughs> XOXO.